Hi, uh, my name is Ger O'Rourke and I am a former customer of laptop chargers that I e um, who hide behind uh, their uh, internet name as being Irish but uh, hide from the general public also and this is my experience. Uh, laptop chargers that I e um, operate from this address. Just straightforward laptop chargers that I e. Um, the big selling point is next day delivery, and then the key thing, which is the main reason I made this video, is that they claim that they are VAT registered uh, and they're an Irish company. Um, and very prominent on their website is a, a Dublin phone number. Uh, along with their website uh, and these I will explain over the next uh, few minutes uh, why I made this video uh, to warn the public about these guys um, who are not what they appear to be. So the first thing is the um, the Dublin based phone number. Uh, when I dealt with them uh, in the at the end of 2018, towards the end of 2018, uh, this number was not it was a call center. Uh, we will see later that they are actually based in Cork, um, and the phone number that you see there is nothing got to do with the company really. It's just a call center with a girl answering and saying they're not available now. Then she passes the the number uh, to them and and they phone you back at some point later. Um, however, in early 2019, that's all changed and this number is rarely answered now and it's just an answering machine telling you to use the uh, um, the uh, internet. I will, however, later uh, in the video, give you a phone number that is uh, valid for them or at least is until they get hold of this video and they change it. Um, so the bottom line is they are uh, giving this outwardly Irish local vet registered company uh, being very genuine uh, but in fact they're not what they seem they're operating out of douglas in uh, cork city uh, douglas village they used to have a company or used to be in some way affiliated apparently uh, or allegedly with um, this it central which is now gone and that shop has now been replaced with Sorry, it has been replaced with a shop front that looks like this, the smoke store. And they are actually operating out of the back of this shop, but the entrance is not through the back. The entrance is down the street, turn right and go in around the back of the buildings and you will see something like this. This is in fact the the, the back of that building that now has the uh, smoke uh, products there and uh, it appears uh, just through research locally that this is where they're operating out of though it hasn't been fully verified uh, but it would be a good guess um, and couriers collect their uh, we'll just give you another shot there of what the back of it looks like there's a car park there so it's quite uh, easy and legal to go into that car park um, and that appears to be their entrance door uh, but if we go back there, it's uh, the smoke store. Apparently, their um, shipments are all picked up out of this store, um, though uh, that's unverified. And also, um, there may or may not be any link between that store and, and them, apart from the fact that the, they're operating out of the back of that store. And the address again is, is this uh, Main Street, Douglas... Kirk. And the reason I found that is that they used their in original invoice used to have IT Central on it. And when I googled that, I found these. And when I questioned them, um, literally the day after I had rang them and questioned them about uh, this website, the website disappeared. So if you google IT Central.ie now, the website has gone. Um, but the most interesting uh, thing is their contact number. And if this is their contact number which um, I managed to, to track down um, and they do answer this <clears throat> but if you um, and they did answer my queries 
but they were very uh, they couldn't my problem was I wanted to exchange the product urgently uh, so I wanted to drop it in I wanted to firstly send it to them and get it back quickly uh, but when in Cork I tried to wanted to drop it into their warehouse and exchange it for the one the correct part and they couldn't meet me they couldn't allow me into the register the warehouse for um, legal reasons I then said okay that's fine how about I meet you near your warehouse they couldn't do that um, so in many instances I think they may be shipping from you know a, a wholesaler in the UK or something like that which is fine by me that's not the problem is the problem is that they're they're hiding behind everything behind the phone number no address um, no proper invoice uh, and no way of contacting them apart from a, a, an email but you try this phone number I got answers from it um, as soon as they see this video it, it probably will be changed pretty quickly uh, and that's it that's our guys at IT Central otherwise uh, known as laptop chargers um, and I'm going to finish by showing you their website uh, and also a quick view of the build, the front of the building behind which they are operating. So let me just get that. So they are, uh, they're behind that uh, shop front, which may have changed at this stage, um, uh, in Main Street, in Douglas, in Cork City.